within Northumbrian Water Group, we have Northumbrian Water that operate in the northeast of England, and we have Essex and Suffolk Water that operate in the southeast of England. So, in total, we serve about four 4.4 million customers uh, with water and sewerage services. We have just under 3,000 employees, and there's some numbers on there that show the scale of the network, and the majority of that is, is underground. Um, every day, we supply nearly 1.1 billion litres of water to our customers, and our performance is monitored um, against multiple targets, and, and these are incentivised through kind of penalties and rewards through, through off what the regulator. If we go on to the next one, please, Justin. In, in terms of the challenge, now I, I mentioned this, the scale of that network. At, at the top end where we have our water treatment works, we, we have a lot of water quality monitoring, as you would expect to, to ensure we are supplying the best quality water into that system. So we have 24 seven uh, monitoring with some really highly accurate probes and things like that. Now, once we get down into the network, we don't, don't have that kind of permanent monitoring in place. We have a, a manual sampling program which is a regulatory requirement to, to ensure that we are kind of supplying the best quality of water and we, we do very well with that. Um, but otherwise, kind of um, local issues within the network, we're, we're relying on customers to inform us that there's a problem. So we just don't have that visibility of what's happening in the network kind of every day, 24 seven. So our challenge to um, for, for this program was to see if we could develop a, a cheap sensor that, that we could kind of roll out on a wider scale across the network and we could get that information back into the business on a regular uh, basis so we could we could make some really important business decisions. Okay, so just very, very quickly, if you go on the next one, this is just, I don't want to um, steal any thunder of what Roger's going to talk you through in, in more detail, but basically we, we kind of had a, a new sensor built from scratch and, and a dashboard that would display that data for us. Um, the, the great news is that we've got this installed on the network at the moment in the northeast of England, so we, we've got it out on site, recording information and sending that in, which is an absolute fantastic achievement in the timescales that we've been working with. Um, really now it's a case of looking at how that's, um, how successfully that operates, kind of the, the accuracy of the result, results we get back and how long that's going to last. So that will really determine um, the next stage, whether we can roll this out on, on a wider scale and kind of what benefits we're going to bring back to the business. I think overall, in, in terms of the program itself, it's been a great experience working with a new company we probably wouldn't have been um, aware of before. Um, they, they've shown fantastic commitment from day one, and I think they've done a terrific job. So if I can invite Roger onto the uh, screen now, and he's going to take you through uh, the details of what they've been doing for the last few months. Great. So, um, yeah, th thanks again for the introduction. Um, it's lovely to be presenting here uh, at the end of the MVP stage on behalf of Risk on Inventure, who were a, a sort of a joint application um, in this venture. And um, yeah, we're really excited to take you through this, um, uh, this presentation today, uh, showing really the product that, that we've managed to develop during this uh, MVP period. Okay, let's get going. So, a, uh, a famous English playwright once said, thousands have lived without love, but none without water. And I think that's a pretty true statement then, uh, still valid today, and uh, I'm predicting long into our futures. Um, but in this present day, we also have further challenges impacting on this basic water resource. Um, populations are on the rise, resources are being stretched ever further, consumer demands going up, temperatures rising and technology developing all the time, bringing real time information ever closer to the customer and end user. And all of this really is impacting how we interact with our resources, our environment, and I would even say each other. Um, we need safe water to function every day, but we now almost uh, kind of take it for granted really. Yet with the challenges that I've just presented above, um, water will be the first response front for any kind of change in climate or demand, which is only going to further increase the pressures. Um, we have to respond to this by safely managing water and using all our means to allow providers to maintain a stable interface between the environment and the consumer in this ever-changing world. Uh, basically, what I'm saying is this isn't just a nice to have, it's kind of critical, really, to our future. So what does safely managed water actually mean? Well, it's the development of tools and processes to monitor the status of your, of your water resource. Um, when events arise in there, uh, to be able to analyze why they occurred uh, and decide the best response to undertake to continuously improve this management cycle. 
We have fantastic utility providers here in the UK that do this well and provide us with this resource every day. But they're under pressure too um, from higher consumer demands and more strict regulatory requirements, all whilst having to deploy lots of resource to implement the safe water strategy that I'm just talking about there. Um, but what if technology could relieve some of that burden, um, allowing real-time visibility of the water, automatically alerting operators to a problem and helping them decide and implement the best response actions to take? Well, that's the system that Risk on Inventure have developed in partnership with NWL, uh, basically a fully remote uh, water quality sensor operating in rural deployments. And this is all combined with dedicated water safety software for real-time viewing and analysis, um, all supported by water management consulting from experts like myself in the field, um, integrating all these components to improve the safe water management cycle resulting in optimum performing UK utilities and the ability to leverage positive impacts in the water sector. Now, the impact uh, from technology sounds wonderful, but what does it look like in real life, uh, you know, in the water space? Um, well, it takes the form of complementing or replacing old style methods of monitoring, um, removing the need for resource intensive testing like manual sampling, um, whilst providing significant increases in, in system monitoring data points over time, it really gives you a different level of visibility. And from a better monitoring and management, the, the customer really starts to reap the rewards, um, providing the ability to replace expensive testing where regulation will allow, and impacting on expensive fines by reacting more quickly to problems ahead of time. Um, there really are compelling numbers to kind of support investment cases in this kind of game changing technology. Um, and these are just the frontline impacts. There are further benefits of improving health through guaranteed clean water provision, reducing waste from leakage, having proactive capability to react to future climate threats, and very topically now, making steps towards net zero by reducing unnecessary trips and manual visits. I think we really should allow technology uh, to deliver these benefits uh, and pass on positive impacts to the next generation. But creating these impacts requires end-to-end -end solutions with skills and technology across the board. Um, people who understand water safety management, uh, the world of electronics and sensing technology, optimum data telemetry, cloud architecture and data science all, all rolled into one. Um, a blend of capability that, that you can trust really to deliver the solution and help water managers monitor this precious resource more closely. Um, and so to achieve this, I'm pleased to announce that two have become one and, and RiskWire is born. Um, this is a coming together of engineering expertise in RiskOn blended with the talents of InVenture and, and their digital capability for a dedicated joint venture company uh, to offer a unique value to the water sector. Um, and out of that partnership comes something that we're calling the Watson range, an end-to-end -end solution for high intensity monitoring of hydraulic and water quality parameters within the drinking water industry. Um, let's take a little look uh, and see what the new and improved safe water journey can look like uh, from this unique product's perspective. So although we always expect it to be clean, um, this vital water resource, which, which is our drinking water, um, comes under threat all the time uh, from leaks, contamination, ingress of varying contaminants and changes in the environment. Um, but now we have the ability to avoid the angry phone call from consumers alerting us to the problem um, and instead uh, to autonomously take water off the main line at regular intervals using computer controlled hydraulics, allowing safe sampling without wasting water, um, presenting the water to high end monitoring sensors, allowing them to sense danger immediately, then utilizing the best in IoT capabilities to reap the benefits of a hands off workload, uh, optimizing packaging data, sending via the cloud to provide instant readings making sure we alert controllers immediately to the problem, allowing for faster response times for maintenance staff, dealing with the issues early, quickly, and correctly, um, enhancing safety while avoiding costly penalties and providing true value to the consumer. But it's not easy to get here. Only five months ago, we were just a team with, with a proof of concept. Now we have a product that spans all the way from the mainline pipe through to the server room. Uh, and we couldn't have done it without support along the way. 
Um, we would like to take this opportunity to give our appreciation to both our industrial partner, NWL, who have been fantastic support, and the Digital Catapult for creating a programme and the space to bring this product to reality. Um, we look forward to um, being partners, hopefully long after the event tonight. Um, and I wrap up with uh, another quote, an adage really, that, that indicates our journey from here, in that you, you can't manage what, what you can't measure. Um, but also more importantly, you can't improve what you don't measure. And we know that we can improve and provide a better, more secure, safe management process for this vital resource, saving money for our utilities and improving resource management into the future. Let's utilize technology for the good via the new Watson range and help create impact that's good for our utilities, our consumers, and also for the planet.